Emily was born at 24 weeks, so she was born about four months early. And the day she was born, the doctor came in just to tell me that she had about a 4% chance. And I asked myself the question, like, is she gonna see the sunlight? With premature babies, you expect that there's gonna be some things that they have to catch up on. So we ended up getting an MRI, and the MRI actually showed that she had cerebral palsy. So as a mom, it really just taught me that I'm here to give Emily love. That's what being a parent is. We were aware that Emily had the ability to communicate and that there were thoughts that she couldn't get out. We didn't know that Emily could spell. We didn't know that True. Emily could read. She had letters on her wall, and we happened to take them down, and Emily just picked them up and started A through Z, put them all in order. <laughs> when we got the iPad for her and the program that allows her to type and speak, suddenly she had the ability to tell us what she was thinking about. Disneyland. Yes. Emily is my hero because the way she lives her life, how she just runs at it so bravely and so openly. And Emily has moved so many people's lives without saying one word. Emily has taught us that there are so many ways to say I love you without the words. The other thing is we have fun. Just spending time with Emily. We are a happy, happy family and that's something I feel really delighted about and proud mm -hmm. about. Do you see where it says Emily? I think there's a surprise. What does it say? It says, congratulations, you're going to Olani Resort <laughs> and Spa. Going to the Disney Resort in Hawaii.